just look at this view. Will you check this out? Ah, I miss this place so much. Uncle Heavy. Today I'm on location in Clifton Hill, Niagara Falls, Ontario. Look at this. Behind me, this is the Movie Land Wax Museum. This is one of the few attractions in Clifton Hill that I have not done, but I'm doing it today and I'm vlogging it so you can all go along with me. No idea what's going on in there except there's some celebrity wax museum, but we'll check it out and see. Let's go get some tickets and see what kind of trouble I can get into. Do you come along? Let's go in here. Looks like first is Taylor Swift. Never really was a big fan, but you know, I could give credit where credit's due. So. Okay. Meryl Street. Okay, now. I noticed this at two sods. This is Robert De Niro, or so it says here. I, I'm not seeing it, but okay. I'll take their word for it. This is Leonardo with an Oscar. DiCaprio, of course. And uh, Clark Gable. Okay, so who doesn't love Iron Man? I mean, and we've got like Iron Man 3 and Iron, well, I guess, I'll be honest with you, I'm not up to the who's who in the zoo here, but I, uh, this is their likenesses. And Nicole Kidman on a swing from Milan Rouge. Very nice. Looks like they got a Jimmy Fallon set here, and Dan Aykroyd and John Belushi as the Blues Brothers. Let's see if there's a creative way I can set up uh, my camera to be a host. I always knew one day, I down the family. You can say you knew me when. Hi, Jimmy. Gotta be at your show. Now this I have to give a little shout out to my buddy Robbie Wrist, because uh, this is the old generation Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. But, very cool. Okay, I've said this before and I'll say it again. In my opinion, the Michael Keaton Batman and the Jack Nicholson Joker were probably the best Batman and Joker ever. And you know, you could slam me in the comments over it, but I, I just always felt that. Don't you agree? I think this guy takes my picture as I go past. Yep, he does. Okay, we got sound effects here with the Arnold Terminator. Oh yeah. Sarah Connor. Now this one's kind of hard to see because he's behind a fence, but this is Mr. T as B.A. Baracus from the A-Team now. Not a lot of people remember that show these days, but uh, I do. I always do this compared to height-wise. I don't think he was that much taller than me. Yeah, yeah okay, maybe he was. He'd still probably squash me like a grape. Now I know this is a movie reference and I don't know what it is and there's no sign, so Hey, this gives me the opportunity to put it down in the comments if you know who this is. Little Matt Damon action here from The Born Identity and Supremacy. And look up above, it's Christopher Reeve as Superman. In my opinion, the greatest Superman. Sorry. Those are some nice shoes. Bet somebody could walk around all day in shoes like that. And Marlon Brando. I gotta tell you, I'm gonna give you an offer you can't refuse. My son Michael, my son Michael's gonna take over. Okay, I really need to stop this. This, this is such bad. This is why I can't go into wax museums because as soon as the bad celebrity impressions come out, that's that's when you gotta stop. Happy Gilmore, not really looking much like Adam Sandler, I have to say. Say it. Oh behave. Oh behave. Oh come on, you said it a second ago. Yeah, baby! <laughs> nice! 
Okay, fatal attraction. Kind of scary. But I always like Glenn Close. It's got the Predator back there. Indiana Jones, Harrison Ford. It's the Temple of Doom. Very nice. Okay, this is Angelina Jolie as Tomb Raider. Now, oh my gosh. I, this is one of those situations had an incredible crush on Angelina Jolie, so. Hello, Angelina. They got some camping equipment here. Oh my goodness. That's a very big King Kong. What kind of underwear do mummies wear? What kind of underwear do mummies wear? of the tomb. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, that was terrible. That was terrible. Dwayne Johnson, The Rock, of course. Enormous. Gigantic. And it looks like there's a man-eating hippopotamus back here, too. It's, I haven't seen the movie, but um, I'm backing away now. Very, very, very strange. Okay, Lord of the Rings. Can't go wrong with Lord of the Rings. Gandalf, Frodo, and... Gollum back there. Precious. Precious. Okay, sorry, I'm sorry. I absolutely loved Braveheart. It's probably one of my favorite movies, so I think Mel Gibson did an amazing, amazing job in this movie. So, proper credit there. Nice Harry Potter Quidditch shot, all kind of floating over the Quidditch pitch. Look, it even gives you that effect that you're floating high over. I gotta be honest with you, I don't know what movie this is either. I'm not sure who that actor is, but there's a bear and there's a parrot, but uh, here's another one, guys. Let me know what's going on here and comment down below. Okay, I guarantee you I'm going to lose at least one subscriber over this. I did not like Hunger Games. I don't like dystopian children killing each other. Sorry, it's just, I know it's a big popular franchise, but I don't like it. But these mannequins look pretty cool. I do, however, like this guy right here. Hello, E.T. Yeah, I'm not, not sure what that is. That was me leaning too, too much over. Look, they have Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs here. And if you know who's who, they have a little push button thing, and if you push the button, it lights up. There's Grumpy, Dopey, Sleepy. I'm not gonna go through all of them. We all know them. But, uh, yeah. This doesn't look very Disney-like, but still kinda cool. Another one I'm gonna probably lose a few subscribers over. Was not a fan of Twilight. Sorry, guys. Just, I don't get it. Oh. And we've got the Wizard of Oz here. Dorothy, the Tin Man, the Scarecrow, and the Cowardly Lion. Although, is he still the Cowardly Lion? Because he got his courage at the end of the movie, so is he just simply the Lion now, or do we go on calling him the Cowardly Lion? I'll have to think about that and get back to y'all. Of course, we have to have the Simpsons. Barco and I, Caramba. The couch skit featuring Uncle Happy. It's gonna be like 30 years old now, isn't that crazy? Han Solo and Carbonite, okay. Awesome, I'm gonna take this one home. Now this is impressive. I don't think I've ever seen a Darth Vader before in full costume. Very, very cool and Yoda's here. You could see the comparison size-wise to Yoda and Darth Vader and Darth Maul and poor Jar Jar. Jar Jar always gets the bad end of the stick with everything. I. I think Jar Jar tried his best, but just, I don't know. Marilyn Monroe, filming. Everybody trips over that alarm when they go to see E.T. What does this do? Oh, I think it's supposed to spin that wheel. Oh, the cast of characters from Ocean's Eleven. Good movie, I liked it. I think I liked the original though with the Rat Pack. And Eastwood from The Unforgiven. Very nice. I like the backgrounds here. They did a lot of work with the backgrounds in this museum. I have to say that much. 
like look at you know we were just looking at the Ocean's Eleven scene behind me and I mean they've got the rope the wheel it looks very much like a casino so hey, kudos to them for doing that and this is Sean Connery's dressing room do you suppose it's open no it's locked I wonder how many people try that each day Stan Laurel Oliver Hardy two of the greats credit where credits due and this has to be the singer area let's see nope and Margaret Barbara Streisand, Elvis the King, you know he's the king. Reese Witherspoon, I, I don't know the connection there, but okay. Uh, Shania, oh Shania. Now if you saw, well if you saw my video from Two Sods, I love Shania Twain. I love you, just letting you know that. Bette Midler, Miley Cyrus is Hannah Montana, Cher, Justin Bieber. Well, this is Canada, so they have to give credit to Justin Bieber. I think we're going into the scary parts. Elvira, Mistress of the Dark. What am I gonna feel this thing's gonna come to life when I walk past it? No? Well, we got Michael here, and uh, Thriller, which is a good song, but unfortunately it makes me have to talk over it. In the background, there's the creature of the Black Lagoon. It's kind of hiding back there. Boris Karloff's mummy. And this just says Count Dracula. It doesn't say which actor is portraying him, but it's a good Dracula. Come on, splurge, money bag. I have to pay rent, you know. <laughs> now, Frankenstein's monster. Oh, he's coming to life for me. It's alive! It's alive! It's alive! Very cool. Oh, he's a big fan of Frankie. Okay, I'm not entirely sure what this is. I'm a little scared. So, there's a little lever here. Whoa. What's it do? I don't, is it doing something scary? I don't, I don't get it. Maybe it did used to do something? Right. All right, I'm out of here. Freddy Krueger, one of my faves. The Crypt Keeper. And it looks like there is a horror chamber. It's gonna be scary. Whoa, scary, scary. I'm scared. Jump scare. Jump scare coming? I hear I hear air. Ah! That's kind of spooky. Oh, there's gonna be something here. I know there's gonna be something here. I'm running past. Alright, we've got alien. And other alien. I'm a little bit nervous now. What's around the corner? What's around the corner? Scary thing? Ah! Yeah, you knew that was gonna get me. <laughs> Scary. Don't like clowns. Is this gonna light up? Oh, the electric chair. Okay, apparently you can get yourself electrocuted in the electric chair. I've never experienced that before. Let's give it a go. In the of the governor, all pleas for clemency are hereby denied. Yeah, that was fun. Yeah. And this would be the Grand Hall exit. I'm trying to follow 
I'm trying to follow Johnny Depp here, but he keeps turning his back to me no matter what I do. There he is. I, I don't do a good Johnny Depp imitation, so I'm not even gonna try. Same thing, Orlando Bloom, same thing. Can't do it. Mm -hmm. So no, I've never actually seen Aquaman yet. It's on my uh, bucket list of things to do in the Marvel Universe, but uh, not yet. Someday. Captain America, Captain Marvel. Oh, a whole lot of captains here. Just have to get this shot here. Iron Man behind me. Yeah, still haven't seen Infinity War yet either. Sorry, guys. I'm really behind on my really popular movies to see. I have seen Guardians of the Galaxy though. I, I am actually a fan. And there's little, little Groot, big Groot. And we can't forget Spider-Man. Hi, Spidey. Michael Keaton did it better. Hulk smash. It's pretty cool. I'm big on the wax museums as long as they say they start doing the cheesy, cheesy imitations are always bad. That's gonna do it for this vlog. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I really enjoyed making it. If you did, please give me a big thumbs up down below, share this video, tell your friends. If you're new to my channel, check out some of my other videos. If you like them, please consider subscribing. Make sure you hit that bell to so be notified of any future vlogs I put up. Till next time, signing off for Movie Land Wax Museum, Clifton Hill, Niagara Falls, Canada. Bull boy. Scary guy. I'm a little bit nervous now. What's around the corner? What's around the corner? Scary thing? Ah! Yeah, you knew that was gonna get me. <laughs> 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 no! <laughs>